be making basics. What's going on YouTube? Be making basics back again with another dope video. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe because we're coming back to back with bangers. Today's video, I'm gonna give you some real like some sauce, man. I'm giving y'all some sauce for making trap melodies on the piano in Logic Pro 10. Okay, so check this out. Basically, what I'm gonna be showing you is three chords, or I mean not three chords, but three scales that you can use to make trap melodies. All right, this is a fail-proof system here. If you use these three scales, you're going to make some bangers. Now, the first one we're going to talk about is going to be the minor scale. Um, if you're brand new to the piano, obviously we have the piano here. Um, I'm going to be able to give you a formula to play any like minor scale on the keyboard, but we're going to start with C. So basically, the formula to play minor scales is going to be using whole steps and half steps. So you're going to start with the root note, which will be C. And we could actually take this down to like the C3. And then what you're going to do is um, you want to go up a whole step. All right. So you can go one whole step, which if you look at this from here to here, whichever note is right next to it is a half step. So if you skip that semi note and go straight there, that's a whole step. All right. So we're going to be using half steps and whole steps to do these formulas. Then a the whole step. Half step. Whole step, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step. Okay, so basically what we got is whole step, half step, whole step, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step. Let's say it one more time. For a minor scale, any key, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step. It's a little, really that simple. So. Now the cool thing about this is once you learn the formula, literally you just play any of the notes in that scale and make a banging pattern. So like if I was just to look at all the notes that are in that scale, so I could really just take all my fingers and just lay them on all the notes and then just kind of play around and we can make a cool melody. Just playing around a little bit but you can see how this basically knowing the notes in a particular scale can help you out all right now the next thing i want to talk about is what's called a harmonic scale so the harmonic scale is actually almost just like the minor scale the natural minor scale but we're just raising the seventh note um up another half step okay so like in our minor scale so this will be our seventh note so instead of playing this seventh note here, we'll go up a half step. So let's check it out. So again, we're taking that same natural minor um, formula, which is whole step, half step, whole step, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step. And then on the seventh note, instead of doing like going to another whole step, we're going to go another half step above that. So. And this would be from here to here would be a whole step, but we're going to go a whole step plus another half step over that, which would be this one. And then so again, same thing. Once you know that the scale, all the notes, you could literally just kind of like say, all right, what are the notes that? So those are the notes we're playing. We could just pretty much come over here with both our hands and just play around with a melody. Hey, 
Hey, real quick, by the way, did you happen to know that we have something called the Beat Making Master Bundle? Let me show you what's going on with that. Basically, we have all these courses that you can get from BeatMakingBasis.com, courses, sound kits, and templates. The Beat Making Master Bundle is going to come with everything on our site. So check this out. If you really want to learn how to take your beats to the next level, go ahead and grab this Beat Making Master Bundle. This comes with everything that we offer, bro. And you're going to get all the updates. So when we drop new courses, sound kits, loop packs, all that type of stuff, templates, you're going to get all of those new drops. Grab it, man. You can go ahead and use Shop Pay and make payments on it, or you can just go ahead and pay for it right now. It's no problem, man. This is everything you'll get in here. Lots of courses. Come on, lots of drum kits. Look at all this stuff, man. Everything on the site. Go ahead and grab that now. Let's go ahead and get back to the video. All right, so the last chord uh, scale I want to talk about is called Phrygian. All right, and this one is another minor uh, scale. And how this pattern goes, it goes half step. Three whole steps, another half step, and then two whole steps. So half step, whole step, whole step, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step. Let's look at it what it looks like. So yeah, man, those are some those are three scales you can use to make banging trap melodies um, in Logic Pro 10. Let me know what y'all think. Like, leave it in the description below. And also, man, make sure you go to the website, BeatMakingBasics.com. Man, we got courses, kits, lots of different tips and tricks and stuff like that you're going to learn. And take your beats to the next level. Thank you, and I'll see you in the next one. We're out.